North East India's biggest ever investment project, the 27,000 crore semiconductor plant set up by the Tatas in Jaggi Road in Assam, is going to kick start tomorrow with the Bhumi Pujan to be attended by Tata Group Chairman N. Chandrasekhar, five directors of the group, and Assam Chief Minister Himanta Biswa Sharma. The Bhumi Pujan will take place at 1 pm, and arrangements have been made for 5,000 people to attend. Well, this is the biggest ever investment in the Northeast. The semiconductor plant is expected to roll out the first chip next year and will produce 48 million chips per day. Well, this plant will put Assam in the global map. The plant is going to be a mega job generator. Already 1,500 youths from Assam, mostly women, are being trained in Tata facilities in and around Bangalore. So viewers, we will bring you live visuals from Jaggi Road where the plant is being set up. In our later bulletins, we will show you the arrangements going on there ahead of the big day. Well, Jaggi Road is in the outskirts of Guwahati and is about 50 kilometers from the city. But tomorrow is also likely to be a big day for Assam as another Taj Hotel is expected to come up in the state. Well, people uh, private to the development told Northeast Live that N. Chandrasekhar and his team and five directors are expected to meet Chief Minister Sharma and his team in the morning before the Bhumi Pujan and a memorandum of understanding is likely to be signed for the next Taj group of hotels. So viewers, this semiconductor plant is a big deal as computers, the apps, several key medical equipments, many of our high-end smart cars, smart homes, mobile phones all use semiconductors which are also known as semis or chips. In fact, in today's age and time, we cannot think of life without semiconductors. This plant will put Assam in the same league as global chip makers like China, US, South Korea, Taiwan, Japan. All right, so Bhumi Pujan for Northeast India's biggest uh, ever investment project, the 27,000 crore semiconductor plant will be held tomorrow. And to know more on this, I am being joined live with my colleague Arindam Das, uh, who is right there at Ground Zero. So, Arindam, how's the preparation going on there as uh, Northeast India's biggest ever investment project, Bhumi Pujan, will be held there tomorrow in Jagirot? You're right there, so show us the atmosphere. How's the preparations going on for tomorrow, Arindam? Yes, uh, Priya, the stage is all set for the biggest investment in the Northeast. That's the rupees 227,000 crore semiconductor plant that is coming up uh, in Jagi Road in Morigao district of Assam. And this is the location where tomorrow at around 1 p.m. the Bhumi Pujan will take place. Uh, Assam Chief Minister Dr. Himanta Bisho Sharma will be here for the Bhumi Pujan. Apart from that, the chairman of Tata Sons uh, and Chandrasekharan will also be here apart from five other directors of uh, Tata Group. So this is the arrangement that has been made here at uh, Jagi Road. Uh, this is the location where the earlier Hindustan Paper Corporation Limited uh, uh, paper plant was uh, here and right now this place uh, will turn up into a new dimension where the semiconductor plant will be coming up uh, so this uh, entire semiconductor plant it has been planned uh, in an area of uh, 160 acres of uh, land in this area and uh, the MO mou for uh, the, the signing of the land and uh, setting up the, of the plant uh, between assam government and uh, the Tata group already took place and tomorrow is the Bhumi Pujan, the day when the work, the first brick of this uh, semiconductor plant will be laid. So th this is the arrangement uh, where the Bhumi Pujan will uh, take place An arrangement uh, for over 5,000 people have been made in this uh, area. You can see a huge uh, structure has been erected at this uh, location where the arrangements have been made for over 5,000 people to be seated and witness this grand occasion, the 
biggest ever investment of 27,000 crores uh, for the semiconductor plant uh, that is coming up in uh, Jagi Road in Morigam district of Assam. This is the game changer. This is a game changer not only for Assam but for the entire northeast because uh, this is going to g generate a lot of employment. Uh, right now over 1,500 youths, uh, mostly women, are being trained uh, in Bengaluru uh, and they will be directly employed in the semiconductor plant that will be coming up. And apart from that, what we have come to know that an estimated over 30,000 youths will find employment in this uh, mega semiconductor plant that is coming up in Jagi Road in Morigam district of Assam. And there you can see that uh, some cultural troops, they are doing their last minute rehearsals because uh, we have been told that there, there is going to be some cultural performance also here tomorrow when this uh, Bhumi Pujan is uh, going to take place. So these are local youths, uh, local troops who have come up. Uh, they'll be displaying the folk dance and uh, also there'll be songs uh, sung by the various uh, groups. Uh, so arrangements have been made and right now also uh, um, preparations are being done for tomorrow's uh, event and a uh, last minute uh, a patch up has been given uh, to this uh, structure mega structure which has been erected for tomorrow's uh, Bhumi Pujan and as I have said Assam Chief Minister Dr. Himant Sharma the chairman of uh, Tata uh, conduct uh, uh, the chairman of Tata Sons and the Chandra Sekharan and five directors of our uh, Tata uh, group will be here for this uh, mega event that's the Bhumi Pujan of uh, the Tata Semiconductor plant that is coming up in uh, Jagi Road in Morigam district of Assam and uh, as I have said that this is going to be a game changer because uh, uh, this is the biggest ever investment uh, that is coming up not only in the uh, state of Assam but also in the entire northeastern region and talking about the employment 1500 youths uh, mostly women are right now being trained in Bengaluru and they will be directly employed in that uh, semiconductor plant when it will come up and um, an estimated over 30,000 youths will find employment in this uh, semiconductor uh, plant. So the first phase, what uh, we have been told that uh, by March 2025, the first phase of the plant will be functional, will be operational, when the first uh, chip uh, will be uh, produced uh, in this uh, mega plant. So phase-wise, it's going to come up and as I've said, it's a huge area of 160 acres of land where this uh, plant is coming up and uh, if you remember that uh, this is the location where used to be the earlier Hindustan Paper Corporation Limited paper plant. Uh, so right now that place will get transformed, it will get a facelift and the new semiconductor plant will be coming up and this is going to open up a lot of avenues, not only in the semiconductor industry but also in other sectors also because uh, without semiconductors you have already mentioned that life cannot be imagined whether it's be artificial intelligence uh, or for commercial or industrial purposes uh, semiconductors are necessary everywhere in all the electronic gadgets uh, so uh, this is uh, 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 almost a, dr a dream project uh, for the state government and it is coming up uh, uh, and tomorrow is the Bhumi Pujan when the first uh, brick of uh, this semiconductor plant will be laid in the presence of Assam Chief Minister Dr. Himanta Bishu Sharma, the Chairman of uh, Tata Sons and Chandra Sekhar and five directors of the Tata Group. So the Bhumi Pujan is scheduled to start at 1 p.m. tomorrow and uh, right now preparations are underway here at Jagi Road in Moria district uh, for the Bhumi Pujan. Priya. Right, so Arindam, uh, the Tata Group Chairman and Chandra Shekhar along with five directors of the group, they will also be attending the Bhumi Bhujan tomorrow. So at what time are they reaching Guwahati? Well, what we have come to know, uh, uh, when I speak, I'll ask my camera person, Devoji Goro, to show the atmosphere here uh, when I answer your question. Uh, so uh, tomorrow what we have been uh, uh, told that uh, the chairman of Tata Sons and Chandra Shekhar as well as five directors will be arriving in the morning hours, early morning hours and uh, before coming to this location they are going to have a meeting with uh, the Chief Minister of Assam Dr. Himanta Bishu Sharma where uh, there is a likelihood uh, that the Tata group will be signing uh, 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 an MOU to set up another 
five-star hotel in Assam and probably the location for that five-star hotel will be Kaziranga National Park and Tiger Reserve. So as of now, I am saying it's likely that uh, the Tata group will be coming up with uh, another hotel uh, and uh, that is what uh, we have been uh, told and uh, the chairman of uh, Tata Group uh, and Chandrasekhar and five directors will be arriving uh, Guwahati. They'll be landing in Guwahati in the morning hours and after that they are going to have a meeting uh, with the Chief Minister of Assam and there they are going to sign another MOU where uh, probably another uh, hotel will be uh, coming up in Assam. So uh, this is the and after that uh, they will be coming up uh, to this location at Jagirot some 50 kilometers uh, from Guwahati and uh, here uh, the Bhumi Pujan will take place and the time that has been scheduled for the Bhumi Pujan is 1 p.m. Uh, tomorrow afternoon. Priya. Right, and we are uh, also seeing visuals of the girls and boys. They are practicing for tomorrow. So what are the programs uh, lined up for tomorrow after the Bhumi Pujan there? Oh, well, uh, my camera person, Deposit Borough, will show the atmosphere here right now. Uh, right, the preparations uh, for the major mega event, uh, the Bhumi Pujan, is still underway. Uh, last minute touches are being given uh, to not only to the structure but also to the entire place uh, where this mega event is going to take place. Uh, what we've been told that uh, the Bhumi Pujan. You can see two excavators there, two excavators uh, there and uh, that is the place uh, where uh, the Bhumi Pujan uh, will take place. Uh, so the two excavators have been placed uh, face to place, uh, uh, placed uh, face to face uh, with each other, uh, symbolically representing something but uh, we don't know actually what it means but uh, we have been told that both the excavators are placed there face to face. Uh, uh, where the Bhumi Pujan will take place, uh, symbolizing something. And after that, uh, uh, the Bhumi Pujan, you can see that it's the dais, that's the stage where all the dignitaries uh, will be seated. And there they will be delivering their uh, speeches. Uh, Assam Chief Minister Dr. Hemant Bhushar Sharma will deliver his speech. Uh, the chairman of Tata Sons uh, and Chandra Sekhar will deliver his speech. And other people, the dignitaries, uh, will also be present here. They will also be delivering. Uh, their uh, speech uh, and uh, uh, below you can see that uh, that's the arena which has been selected uh, for the performance of various uh, cultural uh, uh, programs uh, like you can see that uh, these are uh, youths, uh, local youths uh, from this area who are right now practicing for tomorrow's event but I have been told that they are going to perform some folk dance and folk songs uh, so that's uh, uh, an overall uh, schedule of uh, tomorrow's uh, event that's coming up. The Bhumi Pujan will take place first, then the dignitaries will be seated on the dais where they will be delivering their speeches and after that uh, there is going to be a cultural uh, program here and it's going to be uh, an hour long program that's going to take place here at Ajagi Road in Morigaon district of Assam and as you can see that uh, this is the mega structure which has been uh, set up at this location for tomorrow's Bhumi Pujan and uh, this uh, structure what we have been told has the capacity uh, for over 5,000 people and they will all be seated to witness this mega event when the biggest ever investment not only in Assam but in the entire North is 27,000 crore semiconductor plan coming up in Assam in the northeast uh, and this is going to be a game changer because uh, as I have said that uh, this is going to put as uh, Ratan Tata has himself said that this semiconductor plant is going to put Assam in the global map right. because without semiconductor nothing is possible in today's life and that's how it's being used and this is going to generate a lot of avenues apart from the generation of uh, employment 1500 youths right now being trained in Bangalore they will be directly employed and uh, apart from that around 30,000 over 30,000 youths will be finding direct or indirect employment in this mega semiconductor plan when it comes up here in Jagirod or Morigan district. Right, Arindam Das, thank you so much for all those details.